Here is the cost of hunger. If you can be hungry one day, the next day you are still hungry, the next day you don't have food, how should you feel? Try to feel yourself, try to understand, try to feel how they are feeling, try to feel how hungry they are. They are very hungry, they don't have food, they don't have the one to tell that they are hungry and even if they tell their parents, their parents have nothing to give them. They are very poor, look at their house, they don't have anything in their house that they can cook for their children. Their children only what they do is just crying every day because they don't have food and when they get food, those food can't do anything about their life because are not nutritious food. That's why in the Central African Republic, we are facing many problems of children that are dying of hunger. What are the cost of hunger? What is the cost of hunger? Why can't we just buy, hung buy food just to remove those hungry, just to remove those hunger from those children? We need to do something about this. Even if you may feel that you can't do anything, but your small donations will mean much, much, much more on their life. Because their parents have nothing to do, only it's just to see their children dying. Just try to feel how those parents are feeling when they don't have food just to give their children, or even when they got food, just food and don't do anything about the life of their children because it is not leech in those nutrients that will give a better help to their children. Only what they see is just to see their children dying when they come to us calling us telling us all oh, my children they are sick. My child is really sick and when we go to their children to see what the problems they have and when we reach at the hospital only thing that they tell us those children are hungry are having a chronic hunger. If there is something that you think you can do today so that you can save the life of those children, just try to do it now. As we as AGCAC, we've taken responsibility just to help those children, whatever, in whatever that we can do. But we need your support, we need your help so that we can do something more than what we did. We are helping more children every day so that we can see if there is something that we can do. We've been doing this for almost one year. So we need your help. We need your mercy. We need you so that you can give one thing, at least one meal to those children who are hungry. They need where to live. You can see where they are living. When land to lands, they don't have where to hide so that they can not feel cold. They don't have crops. So they need your help. Try to do something just to save their life so that they can feel they are not alone, so they can feel there is someone who loves them, so they can feel there is still love in people. Just show kindness and let's buy hunger and let's give what cost that should be given to eliminate hunger from those children so that they cannot keep seeing children dying when they cannot do anything about what is happening to them. Let's do something so that we can save their life. Let's do it today and let's donate something. Check the link in the description and give your donations. And the donations will be much appreciated to those lives. And we'll be showing you what have been done for those children's lives so that you can know what your donations have done. That's how we have to save lives. That's how we have to give back on what God gives us. That's how we we'll get more blessings from God. And that's how we will live happier because there is life that we saved that was about to be lost.